And did I tell you she called her coffee Kevy Calf? Like a pet name, like they have some secret language that I don't speak. Veronica is the best friend to Fiona Gallagher, who is the head of this family, this crazy dysfunctional family who has issues. They've been best friends for a really long time. She's sort of like an aunt to the kids, godmother. Don't let her sleep in our bed. You said yourself she's a crazy bitch. She is a crazy bitch. And I'm married to Kevin Ball, or fake married or a real ma it happened we had a fake wedding but it all comes out this season season three when we get a knock at the door which everyone has seen that it is his wife that comes back she once tried to beat me to death with a frozen fish because i had asked if there was more broccoli so i'm married I'm to kevin ball and we have this dynamic which is very sexual but it's not just about sex because you see two people on television that really love each other but they just have like a crazy bedroom life. What are you doing? Put that back on. I'm changing. You learned last year that the probability of Veronica having kids was not great. It was not impossible, but it's not great. So if you tell Veronica that there is even a little bit of a possibility to have kids, do you think she's not going to act on that? Look at you. You're a mother to your kids. Doesn't matter you didn't push them out. She's going to do everything she can to try to have kids. So this season, you really see them going through, and she will make discoveries that, you know, maybe her body is not doing what she would like it to do. And in true shameless fashion, the way they go about making sure that the, a child of theirs enters the world will be nothing you've ever seen on television before. Nothing you've ever seen on television before. And when I read the scripts, I was nauseous. Hey! Put your shirt on. Put your shirt on. Hey, I'm changing. Now I'm going to go uh, take a look at your car. Hey. On that foot? I can handle it. If you can handle it, maybe you can handle the dripping faucet in our bathroom. <laughs>